So Matt's making over two grand today. One, two, three, four, five. Pro tip right there, free 99 knowledge. All right, we're back at Matt's storage unit. It's pretty much developing to be the Matt show. You need to make a YouTube. Right. <laughs> so this couch right here behind me is what we like to call a big lots couch. You can tell the quality's not like a gallery furniture, or like a Cindy Crawford. The quality's not as good. Anyway, somehow Matt managed to sell that thing for $825 with delivery. I've got no idea how. I've sold both of my Cindy Crawfords for 700 and he's selling a Big Lots couch for 825 I don't know what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> Just pick this couch up. This one's super nice. He got it for 320 and he already has a buyer for it. He literally just unloaded it. He's already got a potential buyer for it. A couch that he's picking up later that he's also already got a potential buyer for. So once you start having couches, you start getting like a lot of connections with people that are interested in couches and then when something sells you can just shoot them your other inventory and probably like five times out of ten they'll say yes i usually leave it up for like another two days uh because you'll still get messages coming in and uh, i'll just shoot on my current inventory the pro tip right there free 99 knowledge it's time for delivery work of art trying to get these things loaded up in the back of a truck you kind of just got to stand back and appreciate it All right, couch number two for my boy right here. Selling. You want to go deliver it right now for 750? 750, yeah. 750. He literally just picked this up today for 320, um, and then he just sold that other one in the last clip for 825. And then you're gonna go pick another one up around the same area yeah. after you deliver this one, and you already have a buyer for it. Taking it straight to him. And that one's selling for 750. So Matt's making over two grand today. Twenty three hundred? Yeah. Maybe twenty three hundred dollars today. All in a day's work. I'm not going with him for these. So he's he's gonna lone wolf it. Yep. And we'll raw dog it. <laughs> Alright, I just pulled up to Walmart. I need to get a paint pen to touch up a little bit of that couch where it's starting to chip off. just fixed the well kind of fixed the the scratching that was on the wood and I was gonna drag it out to take pictures again but I don't have the furniture dollies because they're in the box truck now I need to buy a set for here cuz this just happened if it ain't one thing it's the next 
So always use furniture dollies. The wood can chip and then you're left with this mess. We gotta switch over to the box truck. We are going to deliver that leather couch for $500 with delivery. Got it for 250, selling for five. So it's a cool 250 profit. Sold the couch for $500, delivered it 30 minutes away. We're back at the storage unit now. And we took his old couch. It's a nice couch, just needs some work. All right, now that we have the furniture dollies, I dragged it out and I'm gonna take pictures of it again with it fixed up a little bit. You can still kind of see it from here, but it is way better than what it was. And that should be a wrap for today. All right, here it is. Pretty nice, actually, you can see the wooden stuff is popping out right here. It's where it busted. Welcome back, beautiful people. Today, we're going to deliver the tan Cindy Crawford sectional couch for $700. It's going like an hour away. Um, I sent the people a video first so they can confirm that it is what they want. I want to drive all the way out there and then have them not want it. We're going to load it up and get this money. delivered the couch they paid us in cash 700 bucks one two three four five six two four six eight ten seven seven hundred bucks and we're almost back to the storage unit now we got to make a quick repair on that couch that we got for free let's get it it does have this stain right here um, it was a pen actually I've been trying to get it out for a while but it's kind of coming out, but it's still definitely there. I'll work on it a little bit more. It's coming out a little bit more. Actually, I just kind of tried to touch it up a little bit more with this Rooms to Go fabric cleaner. This stuff is awesome. It might even come out completely. This puppy right here. See, there's some wood poking out in the back. There's actually a broken beam right here that needs to be uh, re-drilled on. Let's see, there's actually the broken beam right there. So it really ju it just needs to be attached back onto this. Got the drill. We're gonna see what we can do. All right, that's not too bad. That wood, it's not popping out the back anymore. You can see there's a little bit of loose fabric because it kind of stretched from where it was poking out. But other than that, solid is one solid piece again. Back brace is good. Now she just needs a really good cleaning. are actually coming to look at this couch right now. I'm just trying to finish cleaning it up just a little bit so that way 
can be nice and clean whenever they come. All right, the people just got here. Showtime. People came, they saw it, and they didn't buy it. It'd be like that sometimes though. It's a nice couch, I got it for, I mean, it's a couch, I got it for free. I told them I could do it for 300 delivered to the third floor, but couldn't sell them on it. So I'm gonna call it a day for now. So the update is the people that wanted to look at this white couch aren't coming. They said that they're stuck in a meeting. I just ended up sending them videos and they said just to go ahead and bring it. Sell on this one. Where is it? Right here. Oh wait, this is weird. Right here. Sell on this one. Uh, the one that we fixed up earlier. Load it up and go deliver it. Got this one for free, keep in mind. And we're selling it for $400. $400 profit on this one. Couch sold, ladies and gentlemen. We just delivered it. I'm back in the box truck now. Uh, they paid me $400 on Zelle. That's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I put a little bit more time into editing. So hopefully you guys liked the video. Uh, definitely leave a like. I was up for like six hours editing this video. Um, so one like goes a long way. As, as always, subscribing helps also. I'm trying to hit, I know it's a stretch, but 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I'm going to be posting two videos a week, pouring my heart out into editing and filming. So, 100,000 subscribers by 2023. Let's do it. Each and every one of you guys means so much to me. Thank you so much for subscribing. If you have any questions, as always, let me know in the comments. I love to talk to you guys. Love to answer any questions. Y'all have a good one. Peace.